have a new song for y'all. The song is called The Gods of the Copybook Headings, and the lyrics are the poem written by Rudyard Kipling, the same guy who wrote The Jungle Book. But don't let that fool you. This isn't some tale about talking animals. This is a hard-hitting, no-nonsense critique of human nature and the inevitable consequences of ignoring good old-fashioned common sense. The poem is called The Gods of the Copybook Headings. And let me tell you, Kipling isn't pulling any punches. Now, copybook headings, stay with me here, were these moral sayings the kids used to write out in school to practice their penmanship? You know, gems like honesty is the best policy and if you don't work, you don't eat. These weren't just filler, they were the bedrock of common sense and Kipling treats them with the respect they deserve. But here's where it gets really interesting. Kipling is essentially saying you can ignore reality, but you can't escape the consequences of ignoring reality. And that's where the humor comes in. The poem almost chuckles at the way humanity keeps falling for the same old tricks, like a dog chasing its tail. We chase after these utopian fantasies, thinking we're so clever, but we end up right back where we started, sometimes in worse shape. So what's the takeaway? It's simple. Don't get caught up in the latest fad or slick sales pitch that promises you the moon. Stick to the basics, the truths that have stood the test of time. Because when the chips are down and they always will be, it's the tried and true that will see you through. Kipling knew it, and if you're smart, you'll take his advice to heart. Rudyard Kipling's poem, The Gods of the Copybook Headings, was written and published in 1919. It came out shortly after World War I, during a time of significant social and political upheaval, which is reflected in the poem's themes of timeless wisdom versus fleeting modern ideals. Now, here is version one of the gods of the copybook heading.
Okay. 